All right, guys, welcome back. So I apologize for looking rough today. As a lot of you know, I've been going back and forth to Seattle helping my father who broke his hip a few weeks ago. So that has been quite an ordeal. Been back and forth to Seattle so many times, I'm starting to feel like I'm on one of those five day benders again, except without the fun parts. And today we're gonna to be taking a look at something that I think could be of interest to a lot of people out there considering how big the jewel became because here we've got something that is basically on the same line as the jewel but about half the price so i'm gonna tell you guys what you get and we're gonna see how this thing works and whether or not this is gonna be a jewel killer So that's right guys, we are looking at the My Blue with the My Blue Intense Nicotine Liquid Pods from Blue.com today on Indoor Smokers. Thought I forgot that part, huh? So the reason I do think that having something as easily accessible as Blue is a nice way to start for people just getting off the icky sticks, because when I first started, it was actually a Blue kit that got me off cigarettes originally. But back when I had my first Blue pack, you had to order them online. They weren't available in stores or anything. And one of the problems I always would have was if my replacement pods didn't arrive on time, man, I was screwed. And then I didn't want to go back to smoking, so I ended up starting to smoke cigars. I would pick up like one or two cigars, kind of those little flavored, the um, Koa, COA, or Acid. Anybody who's into cigars are really nice flavored cigars. And those things ended up, I think, being more addictive than the cigarettes. I still miss the cigars more than I miss the cigarettes. But it's dangerous to not have access to your replacement e-liquid or pods or whatever you're vaping on. So something like My Blue is a nice way just to get in, dip your toe into the waters of vaping, see if you like it or not. This kit basically right here that's gonna come with a two pack and the micro USB charge kit which is gonna charge your battery right here. This is gonna run you $10. That'll make you holla. So much cheaper than the $50 starting price tag on the Jewel. Now some people are gonna say, okay, but the Jewel starter kit comes with four pods instead of two, but that's deceiving because the Jewels are 0.7 mil pods. The My Blues are 1.5 mil pods. So two pods of My Blue equals three mils of juice, four pods, of the Juul equals 2.8 mils of juice. So you're actually getting more juice in your kit for $10 than you're getting in the Juul for $50. So if you're somebody who's been thinking about trying the Juul or a pod system to help you quit smoking, then you just may want to go ahead and give the My Blue a chance. Now these do use their new um, nicotine liquid pod systems and they have a unique proprietary e-liquid blend with Parasalt. I have not heard of it before, but they said it is the smoothest, mellowest Nick Salt. And then long term, when you are replacing the pods and buying those, you know, if you're going to stick with this thing for a while, you're actually paying a lot more for those on the jewels as well. It is $9.99, $10 for three mils of juice from the blues, or you're going to be paying $15.99 for 2.8 mils of juice, getting four pods from the jewels. So we've established that it is a lot less expensive to vape using the blue than the jewel, but how does it vape? We're gonna have to get down to the actual vaping of the unit itself and then trying out some of their awesome new flavors. So basically their flavors run in either 4% Nick, 2.5% or 3.6%, not necessarily in that order. We got a honeymoon flavor, which is a rich honey flavor. I'm gonna be trying that one as well as the Citra Zing, which is the one I have here. I'm using all of these in the 2.5 which is their lower percentage Nick Salt. Like I said, you can get them all the way up to four. But they also have a Neon Dreams, which is a fruity and creamy blend to lighten up your senses. A Melon Time, a Tobacco Chill, which I'm guessing would be like a menthol. They also have a Mint Sensation, which is a fresh peppermint, extra menthol-y. And then their classic tobacco, authentic tobacco flavor with smoky, nutty undertones. Love the taste of them nuts in my vape. All right, guys, so I'm not going to try all of them. This Nick Salt knocks me out, dude. But we're going to see how much vapor we can get off of this. We're going to try the Honey Moon, which is the honey flavor. I've got a pot of that already out right here in 2.5. And then I've got the Citra Zing, which I do like anything with a little bit of that zing or the zest, whether it's a lemon or a lime or an orange. I always think that's a real nice palate clearing kind of a vape. 
especially if you got any kind of vapors tongue going on and you're not tasting your juices very well. My Marco Rubio impression, how'd you guys like it? Here we go guys, first hit off of the new My Blue. Not your blue, my blue. Damn, still got some throat hit going on for sure, but smoother. You can see I'm not choking or anything off of that. Now that is more of a little <laughs> direct lung hit. Woo! Now that one will hit you. It is a fairly tight draw. There you go, that was a mouth to lung hit right there. But you can see how much vapor production you are able to get off of this thing. The flavor is good. It's like a mild, sort of a mellow, cool, almost like, um, I don't know, some kind of an orange <laughs> tart or something. But not overwhelming, not like too powerful of a zest. So all right, let's go ahead and try this honeydew. It is a rich honey flavor with a creamy exhale. I'm getting creamed on the exhale. All right, here we go. Woo! <laughs> Damn! There you go, is you man enough for that Nick Salts, man. I do like them, I mean, it's not the way I would vape, I ain't gonna tell you that, but like I said, the popularity that Jules tells me for a lot of people, it is appealing. So if you're one of those people, or you've just been thinking about trying vaping, like I said, great introductory product, and you're not putting so much money into it that you're committed to it forever. You know what I mean? If you like vaping and you think it's something that's gonna appeal to you, then you can step up to another sub-ohm vape or something bigger later on. But for now, if you guys want to check out the My Blue and possibly make it your blue, then I'm going to put the link right underneath this video to where you can get one of these kits for $10 right now for My Blue. But all right, guys, if you haven't already, please do subscribe to this channel. Ring that little bell so you get the notifications when the videos go up. I'll be looking a little bit better in the next one. Actually, no promises, but I'll try. And then don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you like the new My Blues or enjoyed yourself at any time during this video. And now I'm going to let you guys get back to doing what you was doing before this video came on. And I'll catch you right back here again tomorrow. Peace.